Hurricane season is here. It's important every member of your family is taken care of when a storm hits. And the time to get ready is now, not when the evacuation order is given. Today on Bentley's Corner, Tim Pandagis went to Carolot to find out what you need to do. First off, make sure that you ID your pet. You should have a collar and a leash and a pet tab. Basics here, folks. Have anything you would need in the event your pet goes missing. This is helpful even without an impending storm. You'll also want tags for the outside of your home, so first responders know there are pets inside. If you evacuate with your pet and you have the sticker on your window, make sure that you write evacuated on it should you leave with your pet so nobody goes into your house looking for pets that are no longer there. Don't forget to pack your pet's crate. You'll need it if you end up in a shelter. That crate can also be used to store all of your go kit items. You'll need at least five days worth of food for each animal. If you use canned food in your kit, please don't forget your can opener. A container to store your food once it's opened, collapsible food and water bowls. Best to pick ones that are easily stored and cleaned. Pet cleanup bags. For cats, there are disposable litter boxes and any pet beds or blankets. Of course, lots of water and a first aid kit, too. Tim Pandagius, 13 News Now. Now, if you must evacuate to a shelter, you may also need vaccination records. So it's best to keep a printed copy of those in your go kit or maybe take a picture of them.